tummy. We're at Melbourne Airport waiting for the arrival of Joe Chi. How excited are you for him to be back in the country? Yeah, look, obviously really excited. Uh, I think the, the whole team, the entire Phoenix fan base, really excited to, to have him back here in Melbourne uh, and representing the Phoenix. Having Joe join the team again, how is that going to enhance the team? Oh, anytime you bring in uh, the best Chinese basketballer in the world, uh, that's going to definitely help uh, your roster. Um, he's just such a rim preference, uh, presence out there on the floor, brings a lot to us uh, offensively as well. So um, looking forward to seeing how he uh, reconnects with the group and fits back in. I'm sure it won't take him very long to, to get the handle of things. So I'm um, really looking forward to getting him on the court tomorrow. The big question is, will Joe play this weekend against the Breakers? Look, I hope so, but we'll find out. We'll see how, he's, uh, how his body reacts uh, from landing today. Uh, obviously, we'll get him through his medical um, this afternoon and tomorrow morning, get him on court, and then um, we'll see uh, how we go from there. We're one and two at the start of the season. We're missing three of our starters. We are finally getting a few bodies back, including Joe. How is that going to amp the team? Uh, look, I think uh, our team started really well. I think there's been a, a lot of really positive signs out of the group. Um, some tremendous effort. Uh, the defensive end of the floor has really sort of picked up from seasons past. So I think uh, by the time we start adding in these pieces, you know, you talk about Gary Brown, Trey Cal, Ryan Brokoff, and now Joe Chi all re entering the lineup. That's a lot of firepower. So um, once you get those offensive weapons back on the court, uh, I think we're going to be a pretty difficult team to deal with.